Hello, hello, and what is up, everybody? Krillik back in action here. A little bit more FTP monster. We're not quite ready on our next pack, but I'm hopefully starting it right away. Um, I am over here at the wall. The wall. And basically the goal is, of this episode, I want to at least set up one magic farm. I don't have it all planned out quite yet. But I was thinking of just doing like an Earth Seeds. Nothing too crazy. But it'll be pretty good. So, for this, I'm going to need some dirt. This wireless access terminal, by the way. So good. So let's get a little bit of dirt here. Uh, do I have a hoe? Oh, yes I do. I have the mattock. Of course I do. Right there. Now, uh, first things first though. We need a way to harvest said items, okay? Now, Magical Farms is a little bit different. There's a couple of really easy ways to harvest it. One of them is a water bucket, right? So I could just go, I could make this farm. Hey, Sigma. I can make this farm, once it grows, just pour water over it. That's all no great. But I want something a little bit more advanced than that. I want something that's going to go in there, pick up things when they're grown, and be good to go. Okay, so I've made this crazy concoction over here. Um, as you can see, I got my goggles back. I made some more. And I got all of this back here. And this is our automated golem maker. Okay, and over here I've had this making some thomium. And it looks like we are actually out. That's okay. Hmm, finally. Wow. Alright. So, basically I have some thomium blocks in here. Let's get uh, at least one more. Might as well. I have them here. A little expensive, but very much worth. So when I click on this, it's going to make thomium golems. What? It better... Okay, there we go. And the hungry chest ate it. So we have our first golem here. And this guy is going to be very vital for us building other things. So these golems are awesome. I love golems. They're a lot of fun. But we need a lot of other things to get them going. One of the first things we need is this golem mancer's bell. So let's actually head on down. I need to make a few things and gather a few resources here. So let's go do that. This map, I don't know why it... If I go under a certain part, it makes it seem like... Yeah. Anyways. So, let's gather the resources that we need. So the first thing we need is the Golomancer's Bell. Do it. No, it's not going to do it. Okay, let's look up Nether Quartz. And a stick... And that goes, I'm assuming, in the other thing. Okay. So we got that. Uh, the other item that we need is... Gather. Uh, no, harvest. Harvest is one. Um, so golems fitted with this core need not be attached to an inventory. They seek out fully grown crops, reeds, and other commonly farmed plants within a small radius and harvest them. The harvested material simply drops to the ground and must be gathered by some other means. Okay, so this guy harvests them. But they're not smart enough to replant the crops. Now, we need to, them to be able to plant the crops again. Okay, order upgrade. Here we go. Harvest golems affixed with this upgrade will upgrade. will now replant the crops. Alright, so... We need the harvest with the order upgrade. So the order upgrade is right here. And it's just some gold nuggets around an order shard. Alright. That's not too bad. And this guy here is a golem animation core with Messis and Meto to work. Okay, so the golem animation core is a little bit of bricks and some night ore. Alright, do we have any bricks we have one brick 
Let's make a few more bricks. Fifteen. I have the auto crafting, so I hope this works. I hope, I hope. I don't have any clay. Really? No clay. No clay, no clay, no clay. I mean, there's probably no way to get clay other than to harvest said clay. Okay, so we are missing some clay. Alright. Well, let's go make the Golem Answers Bell, and then I'll do a quick pause in the video, and uh, we'll go find some clay, apparently. Really? I hate it when that thing legs out a little bit. Okay, so let's fly on over. And, oh, we have three. Oh, yeah. We have three. Beautiful. Okay, and our wand. Where in the world is our wand? I made myself another backpack. Uh, hopefully I don't lose it this time. There's our wand. Bam. Okay, we got our bell. Awesome. This guy here is what's going to pick up and set certain things for the golem to do. So... I'm going to grab some clay and be right back. Alrighty, I'm back here and I got some night ore. And we're going to put the bricks around it like so. And get ourselves... Uh, let's get a couple golem animation cores. Why not? Now, for these guys here, we need to upgrade them in the crucible. Um, now, to upgrade them in the crucible, we need the uh, Messus and Meto. Now, Meadow, as far as I know, is only on a hoe. Um, this guy here, we could probably use some wheat. Uh, it's two per, so we can probably get away with that. Um, but the Meadow might be a little more difficult. Uh, let's just grab some quick cobblestone, and we'll make a few stone hoes. And there's going to be a little bit of waste. Um, so, that's, I mean, not advised, I don't think, but, I mean, we can only do what we can do. Um, I don't think there's anything else that does meto. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure there isn't. Um, yeah. So, let's head on over, and I just set up a crucible here on the side doing its own thing right there. So you got the bubbling water. And that's how I made some of this night ore nice and quickly. Uh, but for this stuff, I want to be prepared. Because I don't want to mess any of these up. So I believe for each hoe, you get two meadow. And we needed five. So let's do five hoes. Right? Because that'll give us five uh, or two animation cores, right? And then from that, we also need, uh, we need 10 wheat, right? No, five wheat. So five wheat, five stone hoes should give us 10 of the two that we actually need. Okay, so let's try this. And then we throw the animation core in. So wish me luck. This is kind of a complicated one. Beautiful. We got two. Alright. Now these guys here, they're going to kind of be in the air. See? Flux. Beautiful stuff right there. Mmm. In the world. Why do I keep getting duplicate buckets every time I click on that? And watch, these are probably fake. What? How do I have three buckets now? I th think I just duplicated buckets. Alright. Um, that could be a bug. That uh, could very well be a bug. Uh, if it is, that's infinite iron. That's a pretty big bug, if that's the case. So, yeah. Okay, so we need one more core. 
Um, I might actually... Yeah, let's just... Let's make two of them. Why not? There we go. So we got the two animation cores. So we'll do the same thing again. We'll make five hoes. Uh, one, two, three, four, and five. And we'll get the rest of these animation cores. Okay. Whew. Good luck. Wish me luck. One, two, three, four, five. Boom. Alright, so we got them all. Beautiful. Beautiful. So we got four animation cores. Now, these guys here, if we pull out our golems, we can place them down like so. Look at that. Aren't they pretty? So pretty. And we can install a core on them. Okay. Now this guy here is going to be harvest. And I can pick him up like that. Now this guy here is a harvest golem. Hey, caffeine. Welcome back. Now, if I set him in this area, he is going to grab anything that falls out. Okay? So many hoes. That's right. Okay? But, we need to give him an order upgrade. So let's look at how to make that order upgrade. So it's gold nuggets around an order shard and 10 ordo. Well, guess what? I'm short on ordo. So let me go fill up the wand. And by fill it up, I mean steal it from median German. Ha ha ha, don't tell. Uh, and we'll be back to make that. Alrighty, we are back. We have a full wand. And let's make that first order upgrade. So just like so. With, oh, I guess I could have. It was only 9.5 because of... Yeah, anyways. So now we have the order upgrade as well. Uh, I probably am going to get a new wand soon. Um, yeah. There we go. Fixed it. Fixed it. I said fix it. Beautiful. Fixed it. Dang stinking flux. Nasty stuff. Nasty stuff. Okay, so we can place down our golem. Same way we did before. And you can see that he's kind of looking around for what to do. Now we're going to install the order upgrade. The cool thing about Thaumium golems, and the reason I'm using the highest level Thaumium golem, is because... They can accept two upgrades along with their golem animation core. So I can actually upgrade this guy again with maybe a speed or something like that. Okay. These guys have tons of different upgrades. It's visual range, right? So that makes it him see crops at a farther distance. All that kind of stuff. Attack damage. Uh, carrying capacity, and air, which increases its speed. Uh, for right now, I am just going to leave the one in there. Oh, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit you. I meant to have the golem thing out. Um, so this guy here, if I place him down, right there, he should find that coal crop and harvest it and replant. Excellent. First step done. Oh no. I, I messed it up. Oh well. So, that's exactly what we want from this first guy. Alright? Just the ability to pick up and replant what it is trying to grab. So that's our first step to automating these magical crops. Um, next thing is we need a... Uh, so I got all these harvest cores, and I forgot to get the gatherer core. So we need two golems per farm, approximately. Um, so let's get some more bricks. Sixteen more should do. 
Uh, those will probably need to cook up. So in the meantime, we're going to sit here and do nothing. What? Do you guys expect me to entertain you or something? Like, come on. This is... What? No, just kidding. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Let's get... Let's get some bricks going. Okay, five. Good enough. Good enough for me right now. Alright. So we need one more Nitor as well. Uh, so we'll make that up quickly. And... We can get ourselves another Golem Core. Uh, we should probably make two at a time, just like normal. All that flux. All that flux. Okay. Didn't work that time. Worked like that, though. Okay, let's jump in here. And... I need half of this. And three of you. Okay. Throw it in. Throw it in. Half and half. Okay, two nitor. Beautiful. I always recommend making nitor in the doubles unless you set up an automated system. So let's make another core with the wand. Beautiful. And let's look at what we need for the gatherer. So the gatherer is a little bit easier, as far as I know. Luckrum and Terra. Well, Terra's really easy. That's just dirt. Right? We got two Terra per. That shouldn't be a problem. I'll just do the, uh, what is it, three that's required? Yeah, five. So, we'll just do the three dirt as required. Now, one of the good ones of Luckrum, I'm not sure if Gold Nuggets have it anymore or not, but gold is... No, they don't. Gold is a great source of Luckrum. As far as I remember. There it is, Luckrum. Okay, so you get two Luckrum per piece of gold. So, a quick three gold and three dirt should get this core up and running. So, let's do that. And I'm lagging. And we got ourselves the Golem Core. Excellent. Uh, now this guy here, I, it doesn't require any upgrades. So I could probably use a more simple Golem. Um, like a wooden Golem is quite easy. He will take it and have no problems handling that whatsoever. So we might actually do wood Golems uh, for the uh, standard operation. Now, clay golems as well, or straw is another one. Clay is another one that's also quite good. And, yeah. Wooden golems are a little slow, though. So, I'd prefer to, uh, yeah. I'd prefer to stick with something a little bit better. See, stone's slow. Iron's slow, but they're really good. They can beat up people quite nicely. So, I was thinking we could do the wooden. Uh, yeah, it's a lot cheaper than getting that going. So, let's do that. Where? There you are. Have a nice day, chump. Really? You want to come play, too? Take it on the head. Alright. Let's put that stuff away. Zombie head. Zombie head. Okay. So, let's do the wooden golem. For that, I'm going to remove this and place it on this guy. Now, for those of you that don't remember, that this mnemonic matrix lets you do multiple. So, you can have up to three different recipes stored in this bad boy using the same stuff. See you, Taint. Have a nice day. So, um, for the wooden golem, we just need a piece of a great wood log. Now, if we put that in there, like that, it'll give you this little option. And we can just click on the wood golem, and you'll see it working. And voila. We should have our first wood golem, which we do. Uh, you get a little steam and whatnot. You know, it's kind of cranky. Creepers are afraid of me, by the way. What's that? 
Want to fight? That's what I thought. Alright, so we have a wood golem. This guy is going to do mighty fine for what we need it to do. And let's do that. And that. Get rid of that stuff. Okay, so the wood golem. We'll set him up and install the core, like so. And he should gather anything that's dropped on the ground. So if I place him down and say I drop some dirt, he should run over and grab it. Excellent. It's exactly what we want. Okay, so we can have our two golems ready to go to make our magic farm. So let me actually build the farm. I'm going to do it off camera, I think, for this first one. It's not going to be fully set up or anything, and we're just going to do it into a chest, but it's going to give you a good proof of concept. It's pretty awesome. So, I'll be right back. Alrighty, folks, so I've kind of made a little setup here. Uh, we have a two wide berth in the middle, but that's not the biggest problem. This zombie's the biggest problem. Yeah, Not no more. What did he drop? Oh, is that it? Oh, is that my first trophy? Oh, that's my first trophy. Hype. Alright, so, I set up little 9x9 nine nine farms. Don't want anything too crazy, and I don't think I'm going to set up a, uh, a sprinkler system. So, we're just going to cruise along here. I might need to make a hoe of growth. That might be beneficial. But I'm just going to hoe out the land. Now, this gives pretty good returns on this size. This might even be a little too big. But it's fine. Really? Get out of my house. Can't you see I'm building? Alright, so we have this set up here. Uh, now, for example, we're just going to use earth seeds for right now. Um, so I'm going to plant these down. Because you got to start somewhere, right? Zombies on the other side of my wall. Oh, you angry. You angry. Alright. Making noise. Making noise. It's nice to see mobs, though, because we were having those issues in the last one. Okay, now... These guys should... So this guy here can only see up to 16 blocks. And this guy here can only see up to 16 blocks. One problem is, two 9 by 9s is over 16 blocks. And we need them to be able to see from one end of the farm all the way to the other. Now, if you actually look at this, it is 18 plus 4 22 blocks. So, we need a little upgrade on our golems. Uh, I am going to sleep this night away, though. Because I do not want to fight with skeletons and creepers all night. Like I said, it's nice that they're here. Not that nice, though. They could have stayed away. <laughs> they could have stayed away. Dang freaking guys. Alright, let's put you up. Alright. Trophies. <laughs> I gotta set up a trophy case. Dang. And, of course, an extra fabulous squid farm. These things are a must-have, people. If you don't have them, you are not playing the game correctly. Skeleton, please. Creeper, please. Creeper, please. Have a nice day, chump. Alright, there's another skeleton over here. Let's get rid of him. Oh, you got an enchanted bow. Aren't you special? Leg. Got it. And bye-bye. Alright. So we are here. We planted our earth seeds. And I completely forgot what I was doing. I am making another upgrade. Okay, over here. Butterfly. 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 <laughs> Now, I think that these require gold nuggets as well. And we need some water shards. So we need two of these. So let's put those around like so. Oh, a key ring. Oh, isn't that pretty? 
and throw in the wand. Hi, Enderman. How's it going? And boom. So we got our two upgrades. He looked like he was mad about something. Have a nice day, chump. Where you at, bro? Come fight me, brah. Really? Really? These guys, man. So, so derpy in 1.6. And I think 1.7 for that matter. Okay, so let's get the guys down. Uh, now, I'm hoping that this improves them dramatically so that they can see even farther. No, no, don't run away. Nope, stop it. Okay, let's see how this goes. All right, I'm hoping this works. So the wood golem is going to go on the chest here like so so anything that drops really I'll get those don't worry about it all right don't worry about it oh they're so they're so adorable aren't these guys adorable and then this guy I'm gonna set right here okay now I hope this works this should work they should be able to find everything and gather everything. That is my plan. So, leave a like for this video on the YouTubes. Uh, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Uh, you guys are usually pretty awesome about it, but I like to throw in a little reminder at the end. Um, thank you very much for watching, and have a good one. Hello, friend.